We are on the verge of seeing almost 200 homicides this year. Uh, police are investigating a shooting this morning and several other shootings from this week throughout the city and it has neighbors really scared to see anything. Police have identified two of the people who died this week. As WMAR 2 News, Brittany Verner went back to several neighborhoods today trying to piece together exactly what happened. A 23 year old man was gunned down right here. This makeshift memorial is what loved ones have created for him, and this is just one of the homicides that have happened this week. On Monday, just before one in the morning, police say 23 year old Quentin Manuel was shot to death along East Fayette Street near North Spring Street. People who know and love him left balloons and kind words on a poster at a makeshift memorial they created. Then two days later on Wednesday, just before midnight, police responded to another fatal shooting. This time near Winchester Street and Wheeler Avenue, where 28 year old Charles Saunders was shot and killed. Neighbors nearby heard the shots and ducked for cover, but didn't want to go on camera out of safety precautions, but says this has them concerned about what could happen next. And on Friday, just before 1030 in the morning, police responded to another shooting near St. Mark's Avenue after a 20 year old man was grazed in the head by a bullet. That shooting wasn't fatal, but this highlights three separate incidents in three different locations throughout the city, all leaving the neighbors who heard those shots and witnessed the aftermath on edge. No word on any suspects in this case or any of the other ones, but right now police are still looking for the shooter. Brittany Verner, WMAR 2 News.